careful now. That damn hole. Nearly forgot about it this time. Just one big step. Damn, the door handle just came off in my hand. How am I going to get out of here now? Mitzi? Mitzi, are you there? Shit. Remember the hole, Susan. Jesus. I've got to get out of here. What? Jesus. No. You were not supposed to be here! Why? Did you have to ruin everything? What have you done, you stupid, evil bitch? Who are you? I'm sorry, the door was open? I thought you moved out. You took her away, didn't you? What has she ever done to you? What? Look, sir, you are wrong. I just came here to find my cat. It's gone missing. Yeah, I see. That stupid cat. I've been looking for it too. The little bastard took off with my key. I'm gonna rip him to pieces. any trouble just let me go and I've got a gun I can shoot you right there in your heart it's not worth it Joe I've done you no harm of course you haven't got a heart isn't that right I I have no idea what you're talking about listen I've got to go now all right I'll slowly walk out of here, and you'll never see me again. Calm down. I'll go now, and we'll forget all about this. There's nowhere to go. It's all wrong. No matter what I do. Damn it! Get back here right now and give me that blasted key! Please, don't get angry. 
I don't have any keys. Just sit down and take a deep breath while I make my way out, all right? Come in, come in. There's no need to be afraid. I, I don't buy. Come in already. I might need your help with something. You need my help. I thought you wanted to kill me. Why would I want to kill you? You must be mistaken. Who do you think I am? A complete psycho. Look, I've got enough on my mind right now. I, I just need you to talk some sense into my wife. That's all. Where are we? I really can't remember the name of this town, but I'm pretty sure the hotel is called Quiet Haven. This is a hotel? I know. It's a joke. They shouldn't charge half the price for this dump, if you ask me. This is all just a dream, right? It's funny that you would say that. I've already heard that somewhere today. But if this is a dream, I've been asleep for a very long time. I'm sorry. I just want to leave. Yes, I understand. I wouldn't stay here myself if it was my decision to make. I'm stuck here too. You see, my wife Ivy is in the room to the left. She's a little fragile at the moment. She said she was going to do her makeup, but it's been a week now. Maybe longer. Every time I try to talk to her, she just gets angry and she tells me she's not done yet i've cooked her a meal but she ignores me she never likes when i cook but what's that got to do with me if you talk to her i'll show you the way out i, I promise just go in there and tell her tell her she looks fine she's always so careful about looking perfect okay okay i'll see what i can do So, your wife's been in that room for a week? Now that you bring this up, I think it might have been a month. That's a very long time to stay in one place. She wants to look great. I guess it takes time, but we really have to go now. I think there's a big storm coming. I feel it in my bones. Goodbye, Joe.
Hello? Misery. I is that what you said? No. 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 No! This isn't Ivy! This isn't my wife! It's the monster. It followed me here. It always follows me. No matter what I do. Look, I'm... I'm sorry. You must kill it. What? Why me? You still got that power lean, haven't you? The one you stole from me? How do you even know about it? You must use it to kill her. To strangle her. You're out of your mind. Do it. Strangle the goddamn creature so it never follows me again, or I'll shoot you right here, right now! <laughs> You leave me no choice. Go ahead. Wrap it round her neck and pull it tight. Yes. There's no other way. I... I don't know. Did you just try to strangle me? No. Oh, God, no. I would never do that, Mitzi. I guess I... I must have panicked. I thought you were someone else. Look, I was gone for less than one minute. Really? Somehow it felt longer than that. At least you found the laptop cable. That's good news, because I don't think mine will be any good. Let's see what's on this hard drive, shall we? Well, that was a waste of time. Never mind. At least now we're sure it's not him. Let's just go. I don't want to spend another minute in this place. Hey, did you think of a vegetable? What? I'd asked you to think of a vegetable while I was gone. So? Did you? I... yeah. Sure. Great!
Now, don't tell me. Was it... Carrot? Yes. A carrot. That's amazing. How did you know? That's the secret. I can't tell you that, Mrs. A, or else it wouldn't be a magic trick anymore. Yay, it works every time. Okay, okay. Don't get too big-headed now. Sure, but... I am the greatest! <laughs> Look, I only said it was carrot to be nice. In fact, I thought about celery. I wasn't going to say that you leave me no choice. Yeah, right. Yes. Now, let's go. Joe can come back any minute, and you don't want to meet him. He is not a nice guy. Damn fuse, just keeps tripping. It's like we're living in the Stone Age here. Jesse, can we talk to you please? Later mate, later. I'm really, really busy right now.
Okay. So what do we need? Well, basically, we need three things. Red paint. We've got it already. The dress will make a great costume. We just need it in black. Also, it should look damaged. That's important. Cat Widow is a ghost after all. I'll need some scissors for that. We need some kind of mask. I don't want him to recognize me, obviously.